Hi everybody, I'm Chief Meteorologist Chuck Collins with your 25 weather tracker forecast. And don't be fooled by the sunny, hot weather we had on Monday. We have active weather coming away, courtesy of the former tropical storm Cristobal. Let's get right to the map and see what's happening. Cristobal still coming up the mouth of the Mississippi River, slowly making its way toward western Illinois on Tuesday. And the heavy rain will fall along and west of the line, but east of the line, that's typically where you might get a few spin-up tornadoes and some damaging winds. And look at how the remnants continue to be active all the way up into Hudson Bay, southern Hudson Bay, in Canada. So the effects of Cristobal, well, severe weather, damaging winds, isolated tornadoes after 2 o'clock on Tuesday afternoon. And then even if we don't get severe weather, we'll have strong non thunderstorm winds, gust of 45 miles an hour for several hours and pockets of heavy rain, especially in western Illinois and west of the Mississippi River. Now, as far as that severe weather threat is concerned, it looks like it'll be in the afternoon hours and we have spiraling bands of showers and thunderstorms reaching the I-74 corridor about two or three, continuing to go north uh, to I-80 at about uh, four or five, and then settling down on Tuesday night. But then a cold front comes our way, and that'll increase those winds on Wednesday. Now, here's the severe weather threat from about 2 p.m. Tuesday until dark. Isolated tornadoes can't be ruled out in this scenario. Some scattered large hail and uh, definitely some damaging winds, a possibility out there. Take a look at the future wind gust, and these are non-thunderstorm wind gusts on Tuesday afternoon, gusting near 45. We calm things down a little bit Wednesday morning, but then a cold front comes our way, and that'll give us strong southwesterly winds gusting to about 45 on Wednesday afternoon. But after that, boy, we have a string of nice weather days coming our way. Maybe a morning shower windy on Wednesday and 72. And then look at that 81 on Thursday, 82 on Friday. A dry cold front goes through for the weekend in the 70s and then low 80s next week. So once we get the system out of here, we'll be in good shape for the next several days. Forecast details coming your way on 25 News. I'm Chief Meteorologist Chuck Collins.